Hadith of the Prophet Sallam, he says, Tuhfatul Mu'min al You know how powerful that is? It means the gift of a true believer is death. Why is it a gift? Simple ABC response to that. Allah promises you when you do this, I'll give you this reward. When you fulfill your salah, I'll give you this reward. When you do your psalm or fasting, I'll give you this reward. I'll reward you, multiply it by so much and I'll multiply it. And when you stay away from sin, I'll multiply it. When you, when you do something wrong and you engage in istighfar, I will still write that for you as a reward because you sought forgiveness from us. When are you going to see all those rewards? When are you going to get all those rewards? Imagine the teacher tells you at school, okay, you are first in class, you're going to get a prize. You keep asking the teacher, when is the prize giving? They tell you, 27th of November. You can't wait for 27th of November. When the date comes, you have to get yourself to the school and make sure when your name is called out, you walk up on the stage to collect your what? Collect your prize. If you don't want to go to the prize giving, how are you going to get it? You know you're going to get a prize, but how are you going to get it? You refuse to go to the function or you don't want to get up on the stage. A similar example would be that of Jannah. Allah's promised you, this is your prize. You're going to get this reward, that reward. In order to retrieve it, you need to come to us. You need to come to us. Okay, I want to go to Allah and I want to get my prize. Allah says, you know what we call the coming to us? We call it death. Allahu Akbar. We call it death. I as a mu'min am totally convinced that the day my eyes close, I will absolutely be going to a much better place than I am in right now. Why? Because I have a kalima. I have a shahada. I have iman, I believe in Allah, I surrender to Allah. Wherever I faltered, I seek the forgiveness of Allah. And I try my best. And I'm just a human and Allah knows He's created me as a human. If Adam alayhi salam fell and sought forgiveness and Allah forgave him, if I were to fall and seek forgiveness, do you think the same Allah is not going to forgive me? I'm convinced I'm going to a better place. I can't wait to get back to Allah. It's going to be superb. It's going to be amazing. I've heard that he is Ghafoor, Rahim, Rahman, Wadud. Most forgiving, most passionate, most kind, most loving. How can I think for a moment that I'm not going to go to a better place. In this world, I might have been temporarily at the mercy of someone who's ruthless. Someone might have shown me their power by firing me at work. It's a loss. Someone might have shown me their might by abusing me. We tell them, oh Allah, they are showing us their might. You show them your might. Subhanallah, you never go wrong.